ended legislative session was full of controversy and some hot button issues surrounding education and safety were front and center at a town hall tonight. And one of the biggest, well, is the school vouchers that would pay for private education. Local 24 News anchor Rudy Williams has this local education. Well, Representative London Lamar is holding the first of several town hall meetings right here in Whitehaven. She's bringing a lot of the issues and a lot of bills that were passed in Nashville right here to her constituents, especially when it comes to education and to voting. The people of Whitehaven came to hear firsthand what they've read about in the papers and seen in the media. The laws and rules governing them made on the Hill in Nashville during the past legislative session. So I think it's important as a legislator that I come back to Memphis and make sure my community is informed on all the new laws and issues that were passed up in Nashville while we were away. One of those newly passed laws will send some Tennesseans exchanging their current driver's license for what's called a real ID. A requirement if you don't have a passport for even domestic travel or entry to a federal building or military base. That law takes effect October 2020. Well, then there's the controversial education savings account, also known as school vouchers, Lamar and other Memphis legislators fought against. While the education funding program will provide $7,300 to families to choose the school of their liking, Lamar believes vouchers will have drastic effects. Parents need to be very educated on what's coming down with these new vouchers and how much money will be taken away from the school system because of this new plan. Attendance numbers may have been small for the initial town hall, but Lamar has more scheduled in the near future. Rudy Williams, Local 24 News.